Hey, 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 everyone. Hope you're having a good day. And uh, Queen Cobra just went live. So let's see what she's up to. Apparently she's cooking breakfast, I guess. Oh. Jewel, for now she is, now he is, but I don't think it's gonna stay like that when she goes home. Yeah, come on. <clears throat> Yeah, I was thinking that too. Uh, breakfast, it's a little bit late for breakfast, but hey, whatever. Hi, Isaiah. How are you doing? Oh, I wish I had a Red Bull. Of course. Got to whine about something, right? All right, where'd my glasses go? Oh, you're right, Cernian. She's just touching everything with those bacon, raw bacon hands. Hey, oh, hamburgers. How are you doing? I have, she, apparently she said that the flight is not canceled, but uh, I don't know. I don't know if that's the truth or not. Did she ever confirm if she's pregnant? Yes, she confirmed she is not pregnant, or at least she was not pregnant when the la that last thing went down, and uh, she's had a period since then and everything, so she's not pregnant, but Lord knows there'll probably be another pregnancy scare when she goes home from this trip, if she goes home from this trip, because I'm not convinced that she's going to be going home. I think maybe that's why the flight got canceled, you know what I'm saying? But only time will tell. Why are we muted again? She always does this. She'll start a stream and then mute it. And it's just... Or, like, the other day, she, they had a stream like that they had set um, for a certain time. She did. And it, it was, like, you know, set up, upcoming stream, right? And literally kept it like that for, like, 12 hours straight. People were just oh, commenting shit. and commenting. Damn it. I don't just drop my... Huh? Gross. God. I hate these glasses. Fuck. Does everything have to be a pain in my ass? Seriously. It ain't that serious. Thank you, Ponder. Damn it. Whoa, don't trip, jeez. What the fuck? Oh, what is I'm she so doing? Hungry. Why is she laying out bacon on a on paper? She's not gonna fry the bacon. She's gonna like bake it or grill or broil it or what? Hey Rudolph, how are you doing? Why wouldn't she cook it on the stovetop? Do y'all cook uh, bacon like that? If you're gonna, if I'm gonna make bacon, I'm gonna freaking fry it in a pan. That's just the way it is. Ooh, and she touched. Did she really just touch raw bacon and then touch her face? Hold on. Let me go back. She did. She had to. She was just touching her hair or her face. Watch. With freaking bacon, all raw bacon on her hand. Look, there she went. Gross. Girl, you need to wash them hands. All right, I'll have to cook the bacon in two batches because I'm going to have to cook the... This is plenty of bacon now, but I am going to cook all of it. 
but just not at the moment because after this bacon is done, I'm going to do the biscuits. But I will cook the rest of it. Just need a place to put it. I guess right here is good for now. Over six day old unwashed bean. This is light work for her. <laughs> you got a point. Me too, Joel. I'm surprised you're not drinking yet either. Don't speak too soon. We haven't seen Josh yet. He might be sitting in the living room with a drink already. Baking grease mead. Oh, God, don't give him any ideas. <coughs> Did you order it? Yes, I did. Yeah. You have a four coming. Oh, thank you. But I'll finish them with it. All right. They're going to drink. Did you hear what he just said? That he ordered a four pack for her? I guarantee you it's going to be alcohol. You want to put money on it right now? Anybody want to bet? That's what he's having delivered right there. A four pack for her. Thank you so much, sweetie. You're wonderful. You're like stacking up. Cooties. Ew, is she in there like touching on him and shit when she didn't wash her hands? She did not wash her hands, did she? You have a four pack coming. Oh, thank you. But I'll finish them with it. All right. Thank you so much, sweetie. You're wonderful. You're like stacking up. <laughs> Cooties. <laughs> no, I know. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. All right. So we got one, two, three. I mean, I could be wrong. Maybe it's not alcohol. Maybe it's Red Bull. But mm, I know that she got those monster energy alcohol drinks or whatever that one time that somebody sent to her. And they came in a four pack. So it could be anything. But it's either probably Red Bull or a a alcohol. That would be my guess. Three, four, five, six, seven bacons on there. And I have the oven preheated at 375. And actually, let's see. I should scoot it up one. Scoot this one. Oh, Tina, I feel you. I have I'm there with you at times. I did sleep some last night, but I know how you feel. Insomnia is the it's the worst. Thankfully, I can hang out with you guys when it's happening, and that makes it a lot less annoying. Oh, wait, do they not let you? Hmm. Uh, okay. Oh, there you go. Oh, okay. You gotta do it opposite. Okay. What's up, DM3? How are you doing? Thanks for being here, guys. That makes sense. There we go. Uh, can we bring back the 70s again? The 70s? Why? Why do we want to bring the 70s back? So I need a timer. You haven't slept either, Lethal Curves. We're all, none of us sleep, obviously. Like, <laughs> that's the thing is when I first started doing insomnia streams and stuff, I really thought like, okay, there's probably going to be like five people that are going to watch the stream because people are going to be asleep. But to my surprise, those streams do fairly well. I mean, it'll be two or three o'clock in the morning and I can have over 150 people. Um in there which is just crazy to me but 
I've I've definitely seen that I'm not alone in the uh, insomnia thing because a lot of you deal with it too. What was that? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, gamer fam. Hang in there. Aww. <laughs> Thank you very much for the cash app. I'm not going to say your name. Thank you very you? much. I appreciate that. How are you doing, Mojo? There's Poetic Justice. Love Don't you. break what? The oven? How am I going to break it? Well, I, I was not alive for the 70s, but you know. I really hope Hello, she washed LGBT. her hands. How are you? Hi, Heather. Oh yeah, so eleven thirty-seven. So, um... hey Josh, can you put a timer on your phone? How long? Fifteen minutes. Yes. Wow, he sounds enthused. Hey, just a lurker. How you doing? Hi, Sam. What did you thought you see? You were seeing Sam something dirty, eh? Hey Siri, set a timer for fifteen minutes. Oh wow, that's what? Oh my gosh, the daring eyebrow twins. Can we get some hearts in the chat for the daring eyebrow twins? Your son's girlfriend was murdered yesterday. Three others and seven more injured. Oh my gosh. I am so sorry to hear that. That, oh my gosh, I am so sorry. That is, that's a lot. Um. Wow, I don't even know what to say. I'm just so sorry to hear that. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. All right, so we got timer set for 15 minutes. I don't know if it'll be done in 15 because usually it's mm, one, depending on the oven, and two, it really depends. Like it's about like 15 to 20 minutes to cook. So, and I've never used a vintage oven like this before, which is, it's beautiful. Uh, what? But we can earlier, start. earlier in the week, she was complaining about it. Do y'all remember that? Now she's like, oh, this vintage stove. I love it. Like, girl, stop it. Working on. We're actually no camera. I know. DM3, didn't he? He did not sound like he was in a good mood. Hey, Josh, do you have more than one cookie sheet? Like cookie pan? No, I don't. Oh, I wish I would have known that. I would have bought, uh, I would have bought you some at Walmart. Damn it. I did not know that. All right, well, I'll have to wait till the bacon's done anyway, so. So now what are you going to do? Thank you, Savannah. I appreciate it. I don't know who you are, Mr. Doodle. And you have a cradle of filth wow. tattoo as well. You lost 50 pounds eating red meat, eggs, and bacon. That's amazing. Yes, thank you guys for um, for the hearts for um, the Daring Eyebrow Twins. Uh, yeah, this is live right now, Jewel. No, that cast iron pan is way too small. Damn it, I wish I would have known. I would have seriously bought him another. Really? It's all over the news? Um, the Daring Eyebrow Twins, the, uh, story or whatever. Man, that is so crazy. I am just so sorry. I can't even, like, I don't know, how, how do you even wrap your mind around something like that? Well, I mean... I, maybe, I don't know if this is too personal, but I'll just say that I hope 
whoever did it that there is they're brought to justice for what they did and what happened oh it's like i'm not rushing i'm not going to walmart right now damn it <clears throat> um dm3 has i ever seen mac and me i don't think so it's not ringing any bells <sighs> but if I would have known, I would have bought it all the other million times I went to Walmart. But Apparently, a lot of people right. do, um, um, Dynacat. I said the same thing at first, but quite a few people said they do cook their bacon in the oven. So we maybe we're the weird ones. Yeah. Oh, okay. DM3. Oh. All right, have a good day. Thank you very much. Yeah, you don't know any of my cousins. I don't even know any of my cousins, so how would you know any of them? That's, that's rich. Is she going to talk about the flight, I wonder? Uh, uh. Gosh, I every time, it does not matter what she drinks, every time she burps. And it grosses me out every time, too. Kim, how are you doing? So good to see you. Shani and Rev have been fairly quiet, Jewel. They have. Hello. What's up, everyone? Oops. Love Shack Sarah. I think I know what you're talking about. I've seen those too, and they do come in handy. Right, Megan? They should have her stuff waiting in the in the box changed. They know what's good for them. They yeah, would. So, yeah, I don't remember what kind of seed it is, but um, I tried looking it up before, and I don't know if what I found was actually what it really was. But <clears throat> yeah, I love this necklace. Mm, hello, everyone. Oh, I know what I needed the butter for. Yes. Colleen, I don't. I, I'm so sorry, Colleen. How are you doing? Oh, that's awesome, Kim. Oh, my tummy. Congratulations. Let me, you know, drop the link to your um, channel in the chat if you would like, Kim. So people can go and check you out. Lifeguard they can't go All right, so butter. How much butter do I need on this box? Really, Heather? I need to try that. Let's see. A fourth cup of butter. No, not family guy music in the background. Shit. Uh, most of my jewelry comes from the thrift. Well, used to come from the thrift store, but... Hopefully I don't have to edit anything out but like when she plays family guy and stuff it's kind of like oh i get a little bit worried not since uh goodwill doesn't sell jewelry anymore because they're thieves they're greedy
Thank you very much, Kiwi. I appreciate it. How old is she? I believe she's a couple of years younger than me. I'm 41. I think she's in her late 30s. Does anybody else know exactly how old Jessica is? I think she said 39. What did you say, just to nobody? I don't even know what you said. I, I can't read every little thing. Huh, six six twenty oh that would be so fucking cute that would actually be really cute because that would be the day before my birthday <laughs> my birthday is june 7th so that would actually be really fucking cute june 7th eh? they're for what good side luck that no josh's tummy still doesn't feel good and he's got two o's right next to each other it makes them greedy because people give their uh, jewelry to the thrift stores, probably thinking that it's going to go back to the community when they fucking sell it online for more money instead of people being able to find a good deal. That's how it's greedy. Come on. That's how it's greedy because they literally quit selling or quit, um, yeah, quit selling jewelry in their store. He does, he needs to turn that down because it's kind of ruining the stream, to be honest. As loud as it is, it's like distracting. Or whatever they get, they sell it behind the scenes. Oh, get awkward. Your baby is due in June, July. That's so sweet. Congratulations. Well, that's up to you, just to nobody. That's up to you. It does have a Mary Tyler Moore vibe, doesn't it? I mean, where, when would he be getting this? Yeah, you should be able to go there and buy jewelry. Like, I got these starfish. These are sterling silver. I got these for two twenty five before they quit uh, selling jewelry there. And I love, I love these earrings. But how would, when would he get this syrup stuff? And how am I? I'm all right. Hello, everybody. <laughs> This is just one hello to everyone. No, two dollars and twenty-five cents. Which is a steal. <sighs> Holy shit. Whoa. Whoa, we didn't need that. Um, raining in the desert. You have a friend whose entire job was checking prices that were given to Goodwill and reselling to make money for Goodwill. Goodwill is greedy, sadly. Wow. That's interesting. Hmm. Which is a steal. <sighs> Holy shit. <laughs> it's a steal, and plus I'm not going to sell them because I love them. I've been... Yeah, there's a few times I switched them up, but seriously, I've worn them pretty much almost ever since I bought them. <laughs> I've, like, hardly taken them out. <sighs> All right, bacon is still cooking. I bet you did, DM3. Oh, the police. I got blocked pretty quickly, and she made a community tab post about me, so she does not like your girl, Carrie, okay? She really don't like me. Police don't care if they dig in the donation bins by my house. They don't care if it's, if it's outside. Technically, it's a free-for-all, so. How to deal with pressure? What do you mean? Mm, well, how about you? If you have Instagram, you can message me on Instagram at Naked and Laughing. Yeah, Instagram, Naked and Laughing. 
I don't know what we're doing today, and this is a, it's like a little dress. Yeah, I've got leggings on. Oh, I think it's a shirt. It's just It's long. got a freaking hole in it. All have holes, of course. Can't that have anything probably, nice. Like, probably came from a cigarette burn or something. Oh, thank you, DM3. Really glad you're applying for the lifeguard position, Meg. I just have a few questions. Tina, you want um Jessica's channel or somebody else? If I were to ask you how many times a day you shower, what would you say? Yes, everyone is good. I'm planning on cooking the bratwurst later tonight. Skipping the pace. There's my carnelian. This is all just boilerplate about making sure to hassle the urban kids like they're going to somehow steal the pool. Right, right, right. That was in the application packet you emailed. Okay, well, you're basically hired. The only lifeguard test left is for you to run all sultry in slow motion. Okay, here you go, Tina. I just dropped the link in the chat for you. Yes. Josh bought this for me. Okay, you can work on that. Yeah, as far as I know, they don't have fennel seed in it. Isn't it gorgeous? What's up, Militia, Malicious Miss Melissa? How are you doing? Like, what do you mean outside influences? Yeah, Snuggle Post. I was noticing that yesterday as well. You see your name, Michael. <laughs> Are you over in her chat? Is that what you're talking about? I know, Randall. The family guy is getting really distracted. True, Melissa. Oh, awesome, Michael. Very cool. Yeah, I'm blocked. <laughs> so no writing in her chat for me. Welcome everyone. Step right up and get yourself some coffee. Can we open these people up with some coffee? She's okay. whispering about Here's something. Me? You were in charge of getting the coffee. I was coming up with oh Joe, you did. Oh wow, really? Make it look like we caught that. Okay, here we go. We're having a giant fold of the door mat. How do we do that? Moving <laughs> a bunch of stuff into bags, and I'll keep asking if the next person through the door is Dave. Dave? You Dave? Dave? What about us? You don't have these funny, isn't it, Josh? Josh? I think that you might be right. Um, I think that she might be doing some of the stuff that she's doing to impress him and show him like that she can be a good wife. You know what I mean? Like that she'll I'll, she'll keep the house clean. She'll cook for him. All of those things. I think that she's trying to win him over with it, and I think that it's sweet that she's doing it, and probably, you know, but I don't think that it matters that much to him. I think she's supposed to be leaving tomorrow, but every, there's a rumor going around that she her ticket is canceled, so... Okay. Waiting to get I'm that sure. confirmed. Don't forget to swap yeah. halfway through. Oh, it's amazing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Exactly, DM3. She wants to say, stay so bad. She's complimented his avocado green stove that she bashed all week. I'm a light person now. I can just blow you out. Oh, come on, man. Look, if you let me stay, we'll make one of those viral videos you watch. Right, Melissa? Being a housewife is not as fun as it looks. I am a feral housewife, and it's more than cooking and cleaning, but she's a loony with a hair trigger temper. Yes. Yeah. Her anger um, and her self-control. Um, yeah, it's always going to be a problem. 
it's always going to be a problem for her. I hope for her sake that maybe she gets some help for it, but uh, I don't know. If she hasn't by now, she, you know, people, you have to want help. You know what I mean? And I don't, I'm not so sure she wants the help. Oh, that's awesome. Get awkward. I'm, I'm pretty spoiled too. All right. Thank you. Hold on, people. Right, JJ? Look at all the housewives in the chat. Start the board housewife club. Hell, gross. That's actually not a bad idea, is it? The board housewives club? Turn it into a group of people that do streams or something? That would be fun. Oh, Michael, I see you in the chat over there. You are there now. Yeah, I'm cooking breakfast. Look, there's some more housewives. Love it. I love it too. You know, I get a lot of shit. I've gotten a lot of shit for it for whatever reason. That's why the channel is named, uh, you know, Board Housewife because that's what Shani called me, you know, way back in the beginning when all the drama first happened. Uh, that was her big diss that I was this Board Housewife. So I just kind of ran with that. <laughs> like, hey, there's worse things you could be called, right? And she's called me those worst things too. <laughs> I don't think I deal with it very well. And for the most part, I try to ignore people. I don't go on fucking websites. So the only shit I see is what I see on YouTube. Right. Well, that's where and it's all what at. I mean on that is on my YouTube. I don't click on other people's YouTube videos about me or Josh. I don't. I don't watch any of that. Yes, Tina, that is where it came from. You know what? Maybe in a minute after we're done with uh, Jessica or whatever, I can show you guys that stream and you can uh, see exactly what she said, and that that's the origin of the name. So. That's a start, is you don't go looking for it. Well, that's the thing. They A lot of these people, like, um, well, I'll just say Jules uh, in particular, have a lot to say about the fact that I don't work. And they want to, like, shame me for it in the way that they shame Shani. But the difference is Shani's getting online and grifting and lying for money and things like that. Whereas, sure, I don't work, but I'm not asking anyone else to support our lifestyle. I'm not, you know what I mean? If I'm not expecting you to pay it or whatever, what does it matter to you if I work or I don't work? And I mean, like, the thing about working in that I, that was the first reason why I kind of, besides the fact that I wanted to be a stay-at-home mom, it was that, you know, getting a part-time job or something like that when you have kids it almost it becomes a wash because you have to pay for daycare or babysitting or whatever to watch the child while you're gone. And I would, I worked waiting tables for a little while when I was, um, when Jackson was very young and I was literally working just to go and then spend what I made to pay for the daycare. And so it's like, what's the point if I'm not going to make anything like I'd rather then I'd just rather be at home with them than going and working to just not be making any money either. Um, so that's kind of partly why it uh, started for me. Oh, yeah, Tina, that would be fun. 
I hey, Coraline, how are you? I've thought about that before. Like, to, if anybody, um, you know, is on, if you're on Discord, that's a good place that we could do something like that. Um, and start. I've talked about doing like after stream, like after show type things, where we go and talk about stuff after the fact together. Um, because I think that would be fun. I don't know. What season of Family Guy are you watching, Josh? The newest episode. He says the newest episode. Right, Melissa? That's the thing is that it is definitely um, something I'm grateful for because it's not necessarily something that everybody gets the chance to do. And I could have easily also been a single mom as well um, if Michael and me wouldn't have reconnected when we did, when Jackson was still just a little baby, six months old. But um, if if that hadn't happened, I would have had to work. You know what I mean? And it would have been what it would have been. And that's kind of how I was raised because my mom was a single mom. So, uh, but it worked out a little bit different for me, thankfully. And because now I can't imagine it being any different and not having had that opportunity, you know. Well, she's got a Red Bull there. Hello, everyone. Get delivered. Sorry for the burp. No, you're not. If you were sorry, you wouldn't do it all the time. You do it all the time. No, DM3. Somebody showing up to watch, like her, to watch my kids. I'd be a nervous fucking wreck. No way. I'd be nervous for anybody's kids to be with this chick. I mean, I'm just going to say, she's she doesn't handle stress well, and kids can be stressful. Soros. I oh, see my glasses fall right off my face. Oh my god. Need a new pair. Well, go to Walmart and get a new pair. Yeah, I'm feeling better. Like, whatever kind of sickness this is, I swear to God. I literally was sick from November to half of January just to get sick again. Well, I'm not even monetized, so it doesn't matter. No, we're not broken up. So is she still just waiting on the fucking bacon to get done? Has she even started those biscuits or anything yet? This is going to take all day. This is a moonstone. This is a moonstone. This is uh, jade. And I don't have my other rings on right now. No, it's not Opal. Um, Josh did buy me an Opal ring, though. I don't know if it's been shipped off yet, but he did buy me. I have an Opal ring. It was my great-great-grandmother, uh, her wedding ring. And that's who I'm named after is my great-great-grandmother. In fact, I can show you guys a picture of that. An Opal one. ring, and I can't wait to get it. No, he did not propose. I've already flew on several Boeings. There's no choice I can have in that. Our favorite rock is Crack Rock. Oh, God. Uh, Josh goes live when he wants to. We know. Some chrysoprase or whatever. Some green jasper snake skin. I bought Josh one of these too. I don't know how to pronounce this one. Lapis and a ruby. All right, let's see if this bacon is done. I feel like it is. Mm, that's not true, Kiwi. 
They get me upset all the time. Ah, oh, shit. Well, it's kind of a little bird. What the heck is that? Ugh. Kind of a little burnt, but just on time. Thanks, Josh. Thank you, baby. Oh, I should have got toothpicks, too. That was another thing I meant to get at fucking Walmart the other day. was toothpicks. But... Damn it. Actually, they're not burnt. They're just perfect, actually. Wow, she's being very uh, entertaining, this, this stream. Not... At all. All right. More paper towel on top. All right. Finally, I found that picture. Hold on. So we got that. Uh, I can pour the bacon grease in here. Uh oh. Now what's she gonna do? Oh, come on, get the fuck out of there, you stupid. Girl, what are you doing? What is she doing with the bacon grease? I'm glad you saved my life in the pool. I'm sorry I came here in the first place. Everyone deserves a place of their own. I take that now. I promise I'll treat you better in the future. Here, I'll come right back to this. But this is uh, the picture I was talking about. This is who I'm named after. That, that woman right there, my great great grandparents, um, and that's her wedding ring. It's an opal, um, really, really old ring. So I don't wear it or anything, but um, my mom passed it down to me, so it's kind of cool. All right, let's go back to her. Oh, is she making eggs too? That I get it. Yeah, I can see the baby All right. for that. All right, hub, hub and wow, speak English. Why can't I speak? All right, 425. She's just now starting this, these biscuits. All right, Good there we Lord. go, 425. This is going to take her literally hours. Exactly, Melissa. I have my grandmother's wedding ring as well, and uh, it's what I use now as my wedding ring. So it's really when she passed away two years ago. Um, so it is, it's very special when you have like little things like that that you can keep and to remind you of, um, remind you of them. All right. She is making cooking breakfast really, really uh, much harder than it needs to be. Cooking breakfast food is usually pretty, pretty easy and quick. 
and it's not going that way with her. Oh, hi, Shane. How are you doing? Principal Shepard's Teacher's Lounge and Coffee House. It's kind of like Abbott Elementary, which is amazing. Amazing! You gotta watch hey, Josh, you can turn it up louder if you want. Uh, oh, okay. Why do they want it turned up loud? Are they trying to get, like, people uh, in trouble or something? Or, because I, I think if I remember correctly, um, Jessica Messica had problems because of the Family Guy stuff. So I wonder if that's why they're doing it. If they're doing it on purpose to cause problems for people covering her. Because why would she tell him to turn it up louder? Well, it could be my bra, too, you know. What's that? There's People are saying my chest looks nice, and I said it could be the bra. Well, you're wearing a bra. Because it is a push-up bra, so. So, Perrell, your boobs. <laughs> That's Josh's job. See, the thing is, too, is, like, if she's doing that, then, like, okay, but is she not worried about the, losing her channel? Um, because, you know, couldn't she get a copyright strike for it? Like, if any of our channels, any of the people that are covering her or archiving or whatever, if we got in trouble, like, well, wouldn't she get in trouble, too? Or it's like, does she just not care about getting in trouble? Or, you know, like, I don't. I don't understand it. Right? Exactly what she said. What she said. <laughs> oh, she muted us. She muted us again, guys. Oh, Gamer Fam. I'm so sorry. Can you guys put some hearts in the chat for Gamer Fam? You found out your grandma has cancer. She's 94. Wow. She's lived a long life, though. That's awesome that she's lived to be 94. Um, I hope that she, you know, uh, is able to, they're able to make her comfortable and everything. I'm so sorry to hear it, though. And we got quite, there's a couple of people that have gotten some bad news. Um lately on here i'd always hate to hear it like i always feel like I, there's more i should say but you know what can you say to some of that unfortunately there's not a lot that you can say okay let's fast forward a little bit we do have a little bit of a buffer so let me uh go to where we Aww. okay now she's back In your box, you should put your sandwich on their neck. Aww. And pay you a small chunk. <laughs> the royalty fees. Aww, that would be so cute, Josh. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I really want you to try it. I think you would love it. Girl, you better do less chatting with the fucking looking at the chat and reading comments and more cooking or you're never gonna finish cooking this shit she look what she's doing ideally i'd like to have it she literally has not even like mixed the mix the biscuit stuff up she hasn't done it like this is gonna take forever is it still on mute uh no hold on oh she muted us again <sighs> Yeah, Tropical Red Bull and Poppy Rose are good. Oh, I love that Poppy Rose, especially when it's cold. Well, it's supposed to be cold anyways, but... Um... All right. Now, I like the box. They have the box mix, and they have uh, Frozen. And honestly, I like... Oh, why is this so... Oh, because I had the bowl. And look, I sent Josh these purple Pyrex bowls. No, I'm going to use one. All right. 
Okay, water cheese biscuit mix. So I can do the biscuit. Cam three, no. Cobes is gonna be ready for Wendy's soon. I think I know what you're saying. I think it I know sense. what you're saying there. Actually, you know, I could be cooking those other bacons while I'm doing oh, you know what? Ugh. Yeah. I don't know. Fuck. If I would have done it immediately, yeah, because I'm like, okay. Hi, okay. Astrid. I don't know what to do. How are you doing today, Astrid? Uh, I'll just do this. All right. a little baconator. Maybe I should have used a, uh, I should have used the bigger bowl, probably, too. But, I want my poor tongue. That'll work. Okay, water and cheese. I need half a cup of cheese. Okay, I'm going to fast forward through some of these parts where, wait, what did he just say? Can't make out what what they're saying. All right. Yeah, Pink Barbie. Yes, she did. Yeah, I did a lot of cleaning in this kitchen, and you know, I'm not done, but it's as good as it needs to be for now. So. Thank you. I don't know my favorite moment being with Josh, just being, just being with him, period, you know? Girl, how much cheese you yeah. need? You finished school this week. You'll be a journeyman electrician in a few days. Congratulations, DM3. That's awesome. <laughs> really happy for you. All right, that should be probably like half a cup of cheese. That's more than half a cup, but it'll be good. I was on a bus with a few other people. It was a kind of bus with a bathroom on it. Oh, fancy. And it was sort of like a faux bus. And it was driving on top of the ocean. Yeah, I know he likes cheese. And there was a deep volleyball game going on. And suddenly I was in the game. And I was not good at it. But I think I showed a lot of them. And then I saw a robot, but it was also like it's somehow pink. Do y'all hear that? Hold on. Probably not. Somebody's shooting a gun near here. And it keeps... Can y'all hear that? Wow, I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Damn it. Now they're just shooting one after another, after another, after another. 
Maybe somebody like doing some kind of target practice or something. I say, and I'll be the that's the thing though about living out in the country like <laughs> i'm sure it's just somebody in their yard or something you know what i mean Exactly, JJ. There's a lot of benefits to it, you know what I mean? I think having one partner that stays, I mean, I know it's not for everybody and, uh, you know, um, but there's definitely... Um, pros and cons just like anything else so it's it it's if it fits for you it fits for you you know i don't know why anybody would put anybody down for that like uh, it's just it's a to me it's a dumb thing like it's just ignorant people who say stuff like that are ignorant they obviously just don't get that you know it is a job you know what i mean um it's not like you just get to sit at home all day and do nothing like have responsibilities and I put my pillow over my head. Did you kids hear it? Anyway. Oh, I found Icelandic water in Wyoming at the Dollar Tree. I was so happy. Oh my god. That's so rude. So rude. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna. Ew. Good lord. I'm gonna fast forward through some of this so we can get caught up to what's live, and then I want to show you guys the stream that she did last night that she deleted right afterwards. That bacon does look good. Okay, I'll give her that. No, did I burp? I might have to try baking some bacon because it it looks pretty good. Hi, Sharon. How are you doing? Yeah, she's so ladylike, right? <clears throat> Hail Ozzy. That's what someone said, Josh. You hear me? I, I hear something. I guess I'm glad I'm not even Is he asleep? Ah, I would pay a million dollars for someone to find that quick and get it out of here. Really? Yeah, I can find that. Someone said hell, Ozzy. Someone said hell, Ozzy. Yeah. So is a million like a jumping off point? We negotiate from there? This is for real. I'll give you a dollar. 20 bucks. 10. Because I'm desperate. And you split it. That's my final one. Yay. My <laughs> Snuggle puss. No, it's a drink. Uh, but I thought that the first time I saw it too. It looks like it, doesn't it? But apparently, it's a cup, <laughs> some kind of cup. Stop it! No, 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 no! Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh Lord! Oh shit! Stop it! No! 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 Uh! Uh! I just knocked my water over. Stop! Where's the other paper? Oh! Oh my God! Come on! Damn it! How do you manage to do this? Like a ding dong. Pretty easily. Who does she look like, Sharon? Mm. 
Yeah, Broski, I I would uh oh, damn it, I just spill all of it. I would agree with that. She still has not even gotten the fucking biscuits in the oven yet. Still. Oh my lord. Come on. I don't have time for this right now. Yeah, well, either way, I love Josh, and I'm here for him, so. Yeah, you were uh, really loving him the other night. Bob I Burger. hope he knows yeah. that, I tell him all the time, so. Yeah, get that off of there, and it's going to be another fucking disaster. How do you knock it over? I know, Broski. I try to be as patient as I can. Just drinking does not fucking mix with any of that. What money am I getting? Well, it's just that I was like in the middle of making the biscuits and I gotta stop what I'm doing and I got all this crap on the counter. It's like. At least it was water and nothing else because I just cleaned the countertop with Lysol. Still cleaning up the fucking water. Put on here. Finish the biscuits. At least get them in the oven, my god, woman. I don't know how I burp the way I do. Um, The burps came out, I don't know. Uh oh. Or three years ago. I don't know. One day I just drank something and like it burp like loud as could be. I think I might have only topped it once recently. Back to back at that. I was like, holy shit, what is going on? I don't know. Do not ask me. Uh, here's a hair in my food. My hair, naturally. Ew! Oh, I swear to God. Uh, but literally back to back, I had two huge burps recently. And, that uh, is so gross. I don't know how it happens, and I don't know how the first one happened because... Maybe if you quit running your hands through your hair and then touching the food, it wouldn't be such an issue. Or even better, put your hair up in a ponytail or something so it's not hanging over the food. <laughs> because it's it literally scared me like i was like where did that come from so agoraphobia sucks yeah it does oh, i gotta put my hair back oh. There you go. Should have done oh, wait, that. I, I don't even have a hair tie. Shit. Oh, I'm such a dumbass. I thought I had a hair tie in my hair. I don't. Okay, fuck it then. Let's focus on making food because I'm hungry. The first record I bought, I have no idea. Probably. Mm, probably Guns N' Roses. Hey, 
And Josh, he gets laid a lot, so we'll leave him alone. Why are we talking about him getting laid? Hi, Malcy. How are you doing? It's my first alcohol. I don't know. Too young, underage. I wouldn't be able to tell you. That's what I just said. I bet, Malfi. I know it's been crazy. Hi, Lilith. How are you doing? No, she is not putting her hair up while cooking, and she's already gotten a hair in it. Are you happy? <laughs> are you happy? I can't do it like he did it. All right. My first uh, album that I ever bought, well, or CD, would be um, Alanis Morissette, Jagged Little Pill. Wait, what? Tashi? What is that noise? What is that? Is that like a that sounds like a fucking vibrator or something? I don't know. Couldn't tell you. I wish I knew. <clears throat> I wish I knew. What's the question? Wow, come on, girl. Let's get this going. Um, I'm making... Look, do you see what she doing? She keeps brush going, running her fingers through her hair right over the bowl. What do you think is going to happen? Of course, you're going to be getting hair in it. Like, girl, like, stop touching your fucking hair at least. If you're not going to put it up, like, don't touch it. Cheddar bay biscuits. I've already got baked in, and then I'm going to cook egg. No, that'll only take another hour. <laughs> I was never a beezer. Never. I've never gave foodie beauty money. I was never a beezer. Okay. Speed some of this. And I just wish I could have met him sooner, seriously. I fucking love him. I don't care if anyone else can see why I love him. And it's no one else's. It's not for anyone else to understand. Then quit telling everybody your business. I've already made this before, but... Making it so Josh can have some. He's not really feeling good or hungry, but I hope he eventually tries it. Um, 
Why isn't he feeling good? Because I haven't really been that hungry on this trip either. It's just like twice I've been here to come. I've been here twice to come visit. And I could have already had that other batch of bacon done. I'm such a stupid ass. No, I'm not pregnant. That's not what it is. Right? I what literally have not had like a real appetite since before November. Hi, Bill. And it's only. How are you doing today, Boo? Getting worse and worse. Oh my God! There's still whoever this that is that's shooting this gun is still doing it. Over and over and over again. It's starting to get really annoying. What's adorable, Josh? The G can't sing with the shit. Oh. Uh. 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 Dude. Stop looking at the chat and reading the chat and finish cooking. My God. She doesn't finish anything because she keeps looking at the chat. I show you spoon, but whatever. God. What is on my dress? Look, yeah, um, usually when I'm really stressed out, I'm not hungry, but that's not it. I'm just, I'm just like, I've been sick since like no. Uh oh, muted again. Do with Josh. It's just literally my stomach. This is a fourth cup, right? Just my stomach has been messed up since I was sick the first time, and it's just like <sighs> sick again. It's like not getting any better. Sounds like to me like you might just uh, be doing damage to your body with all the drinking that goes down. You know, if you're feeling sick all the time and she's not drinking right now, neither is he, I don't think. The fact that they feel ill, it could be from the drinking. It could be withdrawal. Their body needs alcohol. Oh, yeah, this is going to look good. Oh, yeah. I mean, not like I haven't made this before. Just Josh hasn't tried it. Oh, my God. She scraped this. Girl, you got to move quicker than this. It's like painful watching it. Oh, come on. Yeah, get out of there. Come on. Stay. <clears throat> no, not from um, alcohol. Grab some apples. Um, I luckily, I guess I wasn't to that point of drinking or whatever that, uh, or uh, maybe the amount that I drank um, wasn't enough because I never went through like anything like that, like any withdrawals when I quit drinking. Now, when I got off of benzodiazepines um that i did have withdrawal and it was fucking torture really like it was bad oh i am so hungry right now but not from alcohol nutrition drinks mm, i probably need a nutrition drink but you need to quit looking okay. at the, the chat and finish putting the biscuits on the thing so you can put it in the oven. Then look at the chat. You're driving me fucking nuts, woman. Yeah, chicken broth sounds good right now. Really get awkward? I used to have that problem, too. I would be really shaky. Um... And I'm on. I, well, what did I, they send you, Josh? I also used to get a really high oh. heart rate, um, 
and the, my doctor put me on a medication called propranolol, which is an, it's a blood pressure medication, but um, it lowers your heart rate too. And um, it also really helps with like tremors or feeling shaky. So um, that could be something to look into maybe in the future if you haven't tried that. I mean, it depends on how bad it is, but it's like, it's something that's not a narcotic, you know what I mean? It doesn't fuck you up or anything like that, but it helps with the symptoms. Like if you deal with like anxiety, for instance, like with mine, my heart rate will go up and I'll be shaky and all of that. It helps with that a lot. Let's find out. Oh, good, cool. Someone's you have that for nightmare flashbacks. Awesome. See it with not. Boone's strawberry hill flavored. I would think Duster wine. probably would make American somebody shaky. DM3. Akari Superior Rum. Awesome stuff. Awesome. And Pink Barbie. Yeah, I noticed that too, Melissa. They don't, it's like they don't have a preference necessarily, really. It's whatever anybody buys them when it comes to the alcohol, they'll drink it. I mean, she was drinking gin that one night. Like, I guess she typically drinks rum. And I think he likes rum quite a bit too. But um, yeah, they drink whatever's around. Well, I appreciate it. JJ, it's a blood pressure medication, a uh, beta blocker, if that's what you're asking about, the propranolol. Um, it's been around for a long time. It's not a new drug or anything like that. Um, you know, you can get it generic form, so it doesn't, you don't have, it's not as expensive. Um, and it's done really well for me. When I got off of benzodiazepines, that's when I got prescribed uh this medication to help with all this those symptoms that i was having and it really really did make a big difference i would i i mean i used to end up in the emergency room a lot for like the year after i got off of um benzos and uh ended up having you know panic attacks where my heart rate would go up really really high and i didn't know why and it would scare me and all of that and um I haven't had to go to the emergency room in like, I don't know, I, like a year and a half or more. I know since I started streaming, I've never had to go. I've been doing this since September of 2022. Um, so it it definitely has helped. I mean, I'm on other medications too, but not, not narcotic. None of it's narcotics. Yeah, it is dangerous to come off the benzos. Mm -hmm. Just like alcohol, is, is that, I, opiates are not, uh, but benzos and alcohol, you can die from the withdrawal. You just smoke well, your joints in the injury. That it helps is. me too, don't get me wrong. And I like my weed as well. So that's just how it goes. There's a little bit left in this for you. I'm sorry, Josh. It's all right. So you just saying to yourself, fuck it. Yes, alcohol is a depressant, but that's no excuse to be. And just so you see, look, she still isn't done putting these on the thing. She still hasn't put the biscuits in the oven yet. And we've been here for an hour and a half. Like, girl, speed it up. So you just up. saying to yourself, fuck it. Yes, alcohol is a depressant, but that's no excuse to be depressed while you're drinking alcohol. Like these assholes who are like, alcoholism is a disease. You're powerless to do anything about it. And I'm like, if people were powerless to do anything about it, they wouldn't choose to go to AA meetings. I'm like, fuck that, dude. Cancer is a goddamn disease. Alcoholism is a choice. What? And then, you know, that's what I'm saying. What? You are in denial. Wow. That's sad. You are in denial. 
cobes. It is most definitely an addiction. It, but is there choices that are made with it? Yeah, you do make a choice whether you're going to give in to that. But you don't have a choice of whether you're going to want to. Or if that's going to be something that you crave. Or if you're, you're struggling. Like that's not, you don't get a choice in that. You have to deal with it. The only choice that you have is how are you going to deal with it? Unhealthy or healthy ways. That's it. HIV is a fucking disease. Alcoholism is a fucking choice. It's so, like how's your day like it's so weird to hear somebody who is clearly an alcoholic saying this. And then, you know, that's what I'm saying. HIV is a fucking disease. Alcoholism is a fucking choice. Like, how's your day going? Oh, just found out I, I got tuberculosis. So, thank you, I can afford the vaccination. How's your day going? Yeah, I'm pretty sick, too. I'm suffering from it. I need another drink. Kiss my ass. Well, then. Boone's Strawberry Hill Flavor Citrus Wine. Huh? Yes, yeah, that's a, the thing, Lil. It's yeah, like, who yeah. would? Who would choose to be an addict? Nobody chooses that. You know what I mean? You, you, you wake up one day and you're there and you're like, how the heck did this happen? But, you know, no one makes a conscious choice to say, oh, yeah, I just want to fucking throw my life away. Like, it usually doesn't work like that. People just want an escape from pain. Oh, that is fucking delightful. I have to drink a whole bottle of that shamelessly. Oh, he's drinking. Did you hear him? The nice thing about buying wine from the stores, you don't gotta make it, but making it's just extra fun. People want to give me shit about you having meltdowns, and it's like, well, I have them too. Because people love to fucking try to, as hard as they can, to piss me off. And it's like, you know, it's irritating. It is so fucking irritating. And then they get mad when I piss them off, which is trying harder to piss me off. It's like, oh, thank you, really you Chronic 420. Be thank you very much. What has triggered him? He's just like going off now. It's like, hey, so and so, what'd you do today? Oh. That's awesome, DM3. That's really oh, awesome no. to hear so that, so that you overcame it. Uh, um, let me look How's and see if he's like. Uh, I'm suffering from a hangover. I need a drink. I'm pretty sick, too. You sit there and go, oh, alcoholism is a disease. I'm like, kiss my ass. It's a choice. Why is he getting so triggered by this? And they don't like it when people become alcoholics, but they glamorize alcohol and make life depressing as fuck, so... Eh. This seems kind of catch all 22 with some bullshit here. Like, okay, don't take drugs, but the ones that the government and the fucking dickass heads have approved... Side effects may include. All right, why can't I find his channel? Side effects may include uncontrollable flatulence, more depression, thoughts of suicide, nosebleeds, or, or trouble with sleeping. Contact your physician if side effects worsen. I just wouldn't take it. Um, well, you know what, can one of you, can y'all, uh, is it just me or where is his channel? I'm trying to find, to look up to see if Cobes is live and I literally can't even find his channel.
Where is it? This is weird. Can y'all tell me? Is it just me? Did she finally get him in the oven, Melissa? So weird. It's hidden for some reason? Why? That's so weird. Um... Let me see. Okay, I found it. Jeez, that's ridiculous. All right. Why isn't this playing? It's not paused anymore. Let me fast forward through whatever this is then, because she's just muted, not the, not on camera. Crazy, that's her. Oh no! I'm All right, here we go. Now she's back. And no, he's not live or anything. So I double checked just to make sure. What's going on? Don't worry about it. I'm just doing... Oh no, I'm not. I'm not talking to you, babe. I'm not talking to you, sweetie. Oh, my bad. You're fine. Why does she keep rubbing her stomach like Not that? Too late. Learn how to hate and forget how to love. Society's mental woods not healing. Drinking what is he doing? The society's going off the rails on a crazy train. Is he <laughs> listening to music or something? Pronouns, because that's just how it goes. <laughs> People identifying as palm trees, and it's weird, I suppose. You're so cute, Josh. I'm not trying to pick up people who are of pronouns, but it's like, and that could be an exaggeration of the truth, but it's like, you got people who identify as, as palm trees. Uh, how does that work, champ? Because you're a human being. Oh, come on. Yeah, well, you're a speciesist. Oh, you found a way to make another phobic word. Great. Wow. <laughs> so that's where you're going now, Cobes? Like, okay. And like, um, I'm not trying to offend nobody, but if you identify as a non-binary flamingo palm tree, I'm like, that's your thing? Cool. It ain't hurting nobody. As long as you don't hurt nobody, I don't care. All I'm, all I'm saying is, how does that work? She's got 830 people mm, watching. Joshy. Where they're just like, you know, flamingo becomes a gender now or some dumb shit. <laughs> I don't think Josh, did like you that. set an alarm for me? Yeah, I think I did. Let me check. No, I did not. Hey Siri, set it up timer for four minutes. Thank you, Siri. Thank you, Josh. Yeah, because it's five minutes since she said that, so I don't want yeah. You're fine. Thank you. Yes. Yeah, the belly rubbing is creeping me out too, Astrid. I don't know what's going on with that. And the big Ed cameo yeah, about her being yeah, pregnant. That was wild. And you have to like accept it because they're trans. Well, hi, Mr. Doodle. <clears throat> Well, I can't pay attention to the chat at every second, you know, because mm -hmm. when I do that, people, oh, it takes an hour to make biscuits. Well, because 
I'm reading the chat and spilling water and yeah, we know. Peanut butter and pickle sandy. They're coming along. Hey, Soren. She's going to eat all the bacon. Hey, Josh, what do you usually melt your butter in? Uh, a bowl in the microwave. Well, I know I saw some video of you melting butter. and I got some country crock in my fridge. Well, I, I have real butter. I have that works too. I only I only don't use country crock, baby, because it's literally one molecule away from being plastic. I don't believe it. No, it's baby, it's not a lie. Uh huh. Hey. Who told you that the people with the tinfoil hats? Uh. Hey, uh, <laughs> Von Beardo. It's a known fact. You don't have to believe it. It well, but, doesn't sound like he does. Seriously, butter is your crock being like that. That sounds like a crock of crap to me. Uh, it's not, Josh. If there? I knew exactly where I heard it, I would show you the proof, but. Uh huh. Uh huh. Josh. Fight. It Fight. is the truth. Fight. Fight. Yes, dear. Fight. Literally, people in my chat are saying it's true, too. Josh, if I had the proof, I would literally show you. Like, I've known about it, like, ages ago. Like, when I was, uh, like, young. I, I couldn't even tell you how old I was. Of course, they're going to say it's true because they want us to argue about it. But no, they don't want us to... You want to that you no, Josh, it's not because they want us to argue. It's because... They want you to think that butter is bad when it's not. That's that's it. We're not arguing. No, I've been using country crock my entire life. I mean, I'm turning out all right. <laughs> I'm just telling you, baby. I'm just telling you that's that's what it is. You don't have to believe me, but it's not an argument. And butter is made from milk and country crock is processed, but it's fine. You can like what you like, baby. I'm not telling you not to. I'm not changing you. Are you sure about that? I'm just telling you that it's literally one molecule away from being plastic. That's all. No, I'm not telling you what to do. Why don't you shut the fuck up? All right, let's look at these. Oh, shut up. Perfect time. God damn, that's twice now. All right. Mm, not yet. Could you do maybe like uh, two more minutes, Josh? Yes, I can. Thank you, baby. Hey, Siri. Set a timer for two minutes. You really needed a timer for two minutes. Two minutes, you dumb cunt. You couldn't, uh, you couldn't look at the clock and figure it and do it in two minutes. You had to set a fucking alarm for two minutes. That's a bit ridiculous. Thank you. And I got a little bell. No, I'm not vaccinated. Not with that most recent stuff, no. <clears throat> Ew, slugs have parasites? Gross. Oh. Everything has Ew. parasites, though. Parasite to the nature of the world.
Josh. You're so you funny, Josh. You're so funny, Josh. Yeah, it's just gross that we all have parasites. It's disgusting. Oh, I'm sorry, Rachel. Okay. Mm, what's the reflection on the ball? <laughs> what reflection? All right, let's see if this is done. Oh, because we cannot burn the biscuits. No, no, no. And I'm so tired of my hair. My hair getting on everything will be the the death of me i swear no just get a hair tie and put it up maybe about one i don't know one or two more minutes can you do one last timer josh mm -hmm. oh my Thank god you. she is annoying with hey, the timer Siri, put a timer on it for two minutes please and that should be good there are no timer sets I know that, Siri, that's why I'm asking you. Hey, Siri, set a time. Mm, I've never heard of that fart. Well, is it trying to get rid of me? You're not going to get rid of me. Nice try. <laughs> no. no, it booted me. Melissa does that every once in a while for whatever reason. Yeah, she did curse me. I have a couple of uh, people cursing me. Like, uh... Here, I'll show you. Mm. It's all right, Josh. Don't worry about it. I'm not worried about it. I'm saying people are fucking morons. I know. But at the end of the day, you have a girlfriend and they don't, all right? Don't let, don't let them get to you. Why is my chat dead all of a sudden? That's weird. My chat is like literally dead. But it's not literally that. Here, we'll come right back to this. Let me show you guys this uh, for any of you who haven't seen it. If you are familiar with Mr. Nick Bravo, he uh, apparently is uh, gonna is doing some type of ritual or some shit against me. I don't know. Here you go. I know some of you are probably wondering uh, if I'm doing any kinds of uh, spill, spells or rituals or whatever. And this is our little familiar, Gracie. And uh, anyway, I'm going to show you some of the books that I have. And I, I want to show you one in particular. The name of this stream, by the way, is, is, is Carrie Paranoid for a Reason? After all, this stuff isn't real, right? And also, I'm not sharing anything that we may or may not be doing simply because those who are potential targets could see uh, 
how to defend themselves against whatnot. But, you know, when you do a spell or whatever, the intention oftentimes is to create problems in their lives. Maybe, uh, you know, their electricity stops working. Uh, they have problems with their Wi-Fi. They lose their job. They, you know, become ill, right? The general feeling of fatigue. You know, and that's what happens. A general feeling of fatigue. The way that he's talking, it's so annoying. And of course he said, oh, they have internet. They might have internet problems. Well, why did he say that? Because last week I was having internet problems. So he wanted to make it seem like somehow whatever the fuck he's doing is why my internet went out. Like, come on. It happens sometimes. You know, you look at certain books like this, you know, The 72 Angels of Magic. And I've heard a black magician once say that if you really want to curse somebody, you don't summon demons, you summon angels. Uh, I have a complete golden dawn system of magic, which we'll use in everything else like that. The Occult Significance of Blood by Rudolf Seidiner, a cornucopia of information regarding the uses of blood magic. I'm not saying that we are using or doing any blood magic. I will just say that in regards to the occult, blood magic is the oldest form of magic, as is uh, sex magic. Just putting that out there. Have a day. Yeah. And then, where's the other one? Let's see. This one's funny. Recently, it's come to my attention that sweet little Carrie thinks that Sibella's a witch. An evil witch. <laughs> no, I said Sibella looks like a witch. I didn't say that Sibella was a witch. I said she looks like a witch, because she does. Or at least a witch. Well, here's the thing, Carrie. We both are. Recently, it's come to my attention that sweet little Carrie thinks that Sibella's a witch. An evil witch. <laughs> or at least a witch. Well, here's the thing, Carrie. We both are. We both are. Oh my god, I'm so scared. What am I gonna do? And here, this is one that he did last night. So, I'm sitting here listening to, uh... I'm I'm just checking out when Carrie is like what Carrie is doing. She's doing a live stream of uh, Jessica fighting with her parents. A oh, fight that probably took place a couple of weeks ago or something. I I didn't I couldn't watch it because I couldn't stand Car uh, Jessica screaming. But I gotta wonder, you know, it made me really think, you know, is Carrie a sadist that she has to watch other people's pain? and then comment on it. You know, is the commentary just a way to hide from the fact that she wants to, you know, shaming these people for their pain is yet another level of... I have sh never shamed anyone for their pain. That's fucking ridiculous. And in fact, I really haven't shamed Jessica at all. But I'm not going to lie and say that what is going on in her life is okay no, she needs to get help. That's not me shaming her. That's just being realistic. Sadism and narcissism on the part of Carrie. You know, she was just like slightly fucked up. She'd be watching it all on her own, flicking her bean and, you know, getting off on it. Ew, and then he, oh, he wants to constantly talk about me flicking my bean. He says that over and over again in these things. And it's so gross. Like, dude, quit talking about stuff like that. Like, you don't talk like that to guys. Don't talk like that to me. You're not talking about guys jacking off or scratching their balls or whatever. Don't talk about my vagina, please. Thank you. You know, she was just like slightly fucked up she'd be watching it all on her own flicking her bean and you know getting off on it being a narcissist 
but she feels the need to like gather this community together and then embarrass these people and then get off on it like <clears throat> a sadistic, psychopathic piece of shit would. So yeah, Carrie's pretty fucked up. Yeah, I'm so fucked up. You have no idea, Nick. Anyway, back to uh, Queen Cobra. Enough of that loser. It is gross. It really is gross. And I I think that it's really sexist. Like, he wouldn't talk to... Like, for instance, me and TJ on the podcast on Tuesday, we... And I'll grab the link to that for you guys if any of you didn't see it. But we did a whole stream, a whole podcast... And TJ called him out hardcore. And do you know what he has said back to that? To TJ? Nothing. Nothing. He hasn't said shit back about it. So it's clear he just feels like he can be more intimidating to me than he can to another man. Let me grab that link for you guys. Oh, I should have left the butter in the fucking fridge. Alright, this knife sucks. Yeah, Joshi needs like a nice knife set. He needs nice cutlery. Ugh. If any of you did not see the, the uh, podcast on Tuesday night, I'm dropping the link in the chat for it right now. So you can watch that later and see exactly what we talked about. It was a fun time. I Yeah, Love Shack Sarah. I, did he I heard about that, uh, what Anton LaVey said on his deathbed. Seemed that he died. When he died, he was very uh, afraid. That he made the wrong choice. Oh yeah, get some hot water on that so that shit don't fucking. I know these biscuits were never gonna they're never gonna get done. Literally it'll be dinner time before she has these biscuits done. She's got that uh, water running again. Um, these are bowls I gave him. Thank you. Was it Cernian? It was a um, hoax or whatever, a myth. I mean, I did hear it. I don't know that it was true, but I just remember hearing it. You. Yes, please. I'm the one that gave him all the purple Pyrex. Okay. We didn't need you to show us, but we believe you. Josh, did the timer go on on that one? So I feel like it's been longer than two minutes. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't heard. Oh, yeah, it was only supposed to be for two more minutes, but it's fine. Keep it on, Josh. <laughs> Right? It's Pyrex, not Crown Jewels. Oh my 
gosh. I'm gonna fast forward through a little bit. You finally get the bat the biscuits done. There they are, folks. She finally fi finished the biscuits. Only took two hours. All right, now I just got to do egg. But before I do egg, no hot. All right. Oh, oh Melissa, though, you have no idea that that situation has gotten even crazier. She is at it again with another person, and it has just been wow. I mean, it's crazy. It's just crazy. I'm gonna put the uh, herb on and then the herb mix. Yeah, Melissa. Apparently, she was trying to, you know, get with Draven, and was sending him inappropriate stuff or whatever. And yeah, it got bad. So apparently, she just has an issue, I guess, where she just shares her nudes like with everybody. She even sent me a picture of her booty, bare booty. I didn't ask for one, and she sent it to me anyway. <laughs> and then cook the egg, and then I'm gonna eat. No, not Shanny, not Shanny. Um, it her, it's her name. Uh, Ashley from Norway, I think is what they what she's called. I can't ever keep up with it though. She's been called a couple of different things. Um, I bought that cast iron for him, and his cooker is also clean as well. I just don't know how to get the knob back on. It broke off last time, and I never had time to clean it. And uh... Asha, that's it. <laughs> yeah, just right. that's anyways. I wish I had a baster. Definitely need a baster. Yeah, well, she's she sent has sent her nudes to quite a few people. I know she sent them to Omni, and Omni was pretty uh, upset about it. I mean, Omni, you know, he's gay. He doesn't want to see pictures of girls' vaginas and shit. Like it's, you know, what I mean. He he was kind of offended by it. Like I didn't take it that serious, but then at the same time, like if she sent them to Michael or something, I wouldn't like it, you know, would it cause a fight between me and him? No, but you know, would I like it? Would I have words to say to her? Yeah. Um, it's just, you know, you just don't do that. And especially like, there are people who do have like porn addiction and thing like, things like that. And if you're just sending somebody something, you're not giving them any kind of like heads up or whatever like you're putting them in a really weird place um a very uncomfortable place and it's not fair to them to do that <laughs> Melissa. Suck a fart of Shani's suck a fart out of Shani's ass. I gotta cook more bacon <laughs> so I gotta turn the oven down. Ah oh, these smell good. Oh, Cubano. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, she I, she told me that she had uh, reached out to Leslie. Like, if you're familiar with Crystal Station and Leslie, um, she was trying to, to uh, you know, trick him into talking to her and stuff, too. Oh, my God. I think it was so pretty today. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't get the brother thing saying that Draven was her brother. That's really weird. But worm, I was a hoe once too. I won't lie. I was a hoe when I was younger <laughs> before I got married. Uh, 
Okay, now we're doing more bacon. When are you going to make the eggs, woman? Thank you, Josh. Yeah, Draven's wife did not appreciate it. She did not. Renee did not appreciate it, from what I heard. Uh, apparently, there was something that went down in the chat um, with when she came onto one of... Uh, Draven's streams and she was in the chat and she said something inappropriate and Renee was in there at the time and it, yeah it was a whole thing it's a fucking limp yep, 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 but it's fine now it's all good alright so I figured out how you can do that yeah we're friends with a limo driver right yeah well you know what I'm saying my baby sister oh that's a, that's the nice party. thick one right there and then this one is thin as shit. Okay, then that's more like prosciutto. Yeah, she likes the seafood salad. It's like they put the prosciutto. And after dinner, we're going to tackle to see if every guy would be for the salad. If they're not like me, I think I do. So I stay tight. And we were going to have a Rainy, you're in your whole face. <laughs> um, Shiloh, she says 15 because her birthday is on the 15th of the month. I can't remember what month. I want to say November, but um, yeah, her birthday's on the 15th, so she looks at that as her lucky number, I guess. <laughs> Oh shit. All right, Josh, can you do one uh, another timer for me? Uh for 15 minutes. Thank you. All right, I wish I had a baster, but I don't. So, and I did not think about that at Walmart. Otherwise, I would have gotten more cookie sheets and toothpicks and a baster. So I don't really know how I'm going to get the butter on. Use a spoon and just dip it and pour it over it. Uh, for right now, yeah, 15 minutes at 400. Oh, Lord, yeah, the Shani and Rev OnlyFans, you, you don't, you will never unsee that, that's for sure. Oh, I guess I could do that. That would probably be easier. Mm, 
God damn, those biscuits are fucking good. All right, now where's my little sauce or spice pack? Okay. <laughs> All right, they smell amazing. Holy shit. All right, now I'm going to do the, uh, the Well, I don't do food hacks. I just cook. But yeah, so everything's done except for the egg. I'm about to do that here in just a second. All right, she is boring me with this. Let's let's, let's get Yeah, I do say here. some wild shit, but you know, people make me say it. They say what? wild shit to me, so I just say it back. People make you say it. Get the fuck out of here. That's bullshit. Come on, phone, stop it. Beer biscuits? No, I have not. All right. Oh, shit. What happened to that? Oh, yeah. I love Rabbit right. Little Bad. She's amazing. Left front. Mm. Oh, I just I think I just heard Cobe say that's tasty wine. So it sounds like he's drinking. Let me go back. Left front. Mm. That's wine. Yeah, I think he said that's tasty wine. Girl, can you really not figure this out? She can't figure out how to frickin' turn the eye on the stove on. Mm. What the I hell? I don't have an accent. I don't know why people think I have an accent, but um, I'm from Virginia Beach. I'm from Virginia Beach, but <clears throat> no, I don't have an accent. Maybe an attitude, but no accent. Oh, you definitely have an oh, attitude. That's smoking. That's probably way too high. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Gonna burn the house down. Thank you, North America and Mud. What is she doing? You love duster with your bacon and biscuits? Perfect. I've only done once in my life, and that was in Florida. Oops. I do. Uh oh. There we go. I love this dress. I've had this thing for. <laughs> I've had this thing forever. <laughs> Oh, 
being fumigated. Yeah, Blue. I just played it a minute ago. He's crazy. What a fucking piece of shit he is. Good to see you, Blue. Oh, God. Rude. No, my friend wanted me to do Kratom in Florida. I don't know why. I just remember I think it was gross or something. All right, here's what we're going to do, because this is boring the fuck out of me. I wanted to show you guys, um, last night she did a live that she deleted. This is just some of the highlights of it, I believe. Um, but I wanted you guys to check this out so that you uh, got to see, because she did go live last night, but then she deleted this right after it was over. She ends up getting kind of triggered um, by the chat. Imagine that. His window was not broken. There, it was just like, I don't know. It's not broken, though. I just couldn't close it, but it's not broken. Yeah, how do you close this? Uh, how do you close this? Uh. God damn it. I guess the window's broken. Wow. I can't close it. She just said it's broken. Did you hear that? Let's listen to that again. Uh. <coughs> God damn it. I guess the window's broken. Can't close it. That's great. No, it didn't break. He's got bottles up on his window still. And like a bottle or two fell. I put him back up. Nothing broke. It's just I woke up in the freezing cold and I couldn't close the window. <clears throat> and nothing broke. Yeah, what I said about Josh the other night was up. I was really drunk and I was pissed off and that is um, definitely not true. Hi Holly, how are you doing? Glad you're here. And we were in a fight and it has nothing to do about none of y'all and um, we've both apologized to each other and uh, yeah, I, I wasn't the other night but you know it takes two to and uh, it takes two to do things and it's it has nothing to do with none of y'all's business and um, yes, what I did say the other night was up and it's not true. I was just being a drunk and when you are drunk, you say f***ed up shit. so, um, it's no excuse, but we've talked about it, and we've apologized to each other, and... That was a lot, though, that you said. A lot. That wasn't just like, oh, I'm a little mad, and, oh, he did this, or whatever. No, you were accusing him of awful things, and, like, saying that he was this awful person that had done all this, you know, fucked up stuff, and was cheating on you, and was all of this, and none of that was true? None of it? Hmm. Yeah, it was not a nice thing for me to say. I just said it was not a nice thing for me to say. I'm apologizing. And we've already apologized to each other a whole ton of times. So, it's between me and him. No, it's not It's not an excuse, but I was drunk and I was being a f***er because my feelings were hurt. And I should have handled it a different way, and I didn't. I'm not perfect, but we've apologized and talked to each other, so that's all that matters, because that's all I wanted to begin with. <laughs> he doesn't want to go live because he doesn't want to. Tell them, Josh. You go live because you want to. No, I'll go live when I want to. I don't feel like going live right now. There, you hear it? No, I shouldn't have been live. No, I shouldn't. But again, tell me that you make the best decisions when you're drunk. Let, let me know. I'm not going to kill his She's channel. Shut the full of excuses. Yeah, that's why he had like f over 5,000 people watching <clears throat> when I went live with him. No, we're not having a baby. So whoever lied to Big Ed is, well, a liar. <laughs> so why wouldn't he go live again and make thousands? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. He, he should go live. But again, he does what he wants. So <clears throat> only getting views because people want Josh. 
And you have his name? Okay, goodbye. <clears throat> You know, we did fight, but as a couple, that's going to happen. But we've seriously apologized to each other, and we've talked about it and made up. So, you know. There's no flight being canceled, people. I think I'd be the first one to know about that. Okay. <laughs> Look, everyone, we... She's talking about the flight is not canceled, is what she's saying, but... ...about it and made up. So, you know. There's no flight being canceled, people. I think I'd be the first one to know about that. Look, everyone, we had our little tiffs and stuff, but we've talked it out, okay? I've apologized to him, he's apologized to me, and all we can... What the heck? Um, I'm not a taking advantage of him, and he actually did have something to apologize for, so thank you very much. Okay, thank you. And it's none of your business, but he actually did have something to apologize for, because that's how it started, so you and leave us alone it's none of your business and that's that we have moved on couples have fights nobody's perfect and you know as long as he's willing to talk to me then, then that's all i wanted that's all i wanted there's nothing more to it there was never any window broke you f josh is your window broke nope thank you thongs hurt buttholes thongs are like good for like a few minutes but you got you can't wear that they will hurt your butt <laughs> What in the? <laughs> no. <laughs> How so the what fuck? if I'm a tread wife and I don't care if Josh likes that or not. Either he can learn to love it or accept it or whatever. Right, Josh? <laughs> and I don't think he minds it, right? Oh, foodie beauty doesn't watch me. That's why someone literally got foodie beauty to unblock me and I would say hi to her in her chat and she so yeah okay she watches me okay <laughs> then then where's foodie beauty if she was in here and see her but obviously that's not true so that's a yeah, fake lie you know please if she watched me she leave a comment this is not a fling you don't think that do you josh what that this is a fling no why would i think that just people are asking if this is serious or if i love josh for his mind body and soul he's a very sweet guy he's funny as I just love how his, you know, he's not afraid to be himself. I love how his mind works, and he's handsome as shit, and I just can't stand the way people treat him. There's no flight canceled, you idiots. No, it's not, Lauren, you stupid bitch. If you actually knew what the phone plans were, you would know. 125 is what I should have bought you. Figure it out. Off your dad every night on a daily basis, and then it's in the air after that. <laughs> it's in the air. Don't care. Figure it out, Lauren. Yeah, people aren't f donating to me. People don't like me. They're not going to donate to me. So so don't even bother posting the link because it's not going to get me anywhere. Wow. I don't expect pe I know people the other night. Wow. Were like, talk about being negative and shit. Like, oh, don't even post it because no one's going to do it. Like, you just said you, you're literally setting yourself up for failure on purpose. Like, I don't get it. We're asking me how much it would cost to move here, and I don't want to talk about that because I don't expect people to do that. If that happened, that would blow my mind, but I also don't expect people to do that either because that would cost a ton of money I don't have or I expect anyone else to have. I've gotten blackout drunk on my channel plenty of times, and you don't see donations coming in. I do it because I'm stupid. Try to make sense. You sound really dumb. You sound really dumb. Okay, he gets blackout drunk for donations. Okay, I get blackout drunk for no donations. Make it make sense, okay? Starfish season. It's the reason to be bees. We've quit talking about our channel. Josh, I wasn't on there. I'm not screaming at him, you stupid. Oh my god, you people are losers. No, how about it's about, it's not everything is your business. There's no arguing, so shut up. There's no arguing. It's just called it's none of your business. You sound right. If Josh wanted to continue watching Family Guy, he would, you Stupid, dumb, gutter, minge, liquor. I'm not taking anything out on Josh. You sound right. All right, I'm going to be getting out? off of here in a few minutes anyways, because you people literally are so miserable. I, I don't understand how all of you are miserable. Almost a thousand miserable f***ers in here. So, <laughs> oh, yeah, the blonde is hotter and younger. Exactly. Exactly. Wow. You people are the most I never knew how many miserable people there were in this world. It's very sad. 
Are you going to watch the Outlaw video, Joshy? No, I'll watch it whenever I feel like watching it. Why not? I'm just asking because I thought you were going to go back to it. I have to go back to it. Yeah, it does make sense. Yeah, it does. Because what am I doing here except being abused? Real I don't have a problem abused. with Josh. I have a problem with the chat. Thank you. Problem with the chat. Problem being with you. By who? Problem with you. Josh has done nothing. Thank you. I'm a giant woman child, and what are you? An abuser? Gotcha. You're an abuser. Okay. What is your problem? How would you feel being a all day? What, what have I done to you? What have I done to you? You people. Hello. You. The chat. Hello. Are you ready? All right. Have a good night, people. I can't even hang out because everyone is so disgusting. So. Poor Cobra. More like poor you. What has Josh done? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> <laughs> what has Josh done? I'm trying to stream and you people have been disgusting to me all night, so. All right, beer's done. Have a good night, people. Sorry the stream sucked because you people are so disgusting, so. All right. Toodaloo, folks. <laughs> oh, Lord. All right. Let's go back to, uh... oh, by the way, this is from The Girl Zone. Let me drop the link in the chat for you guys. And let's go back and see what is happening with breakfast. The fishnet part? I'll find it. Hold on. I also put on vines. I just got they're still here. Come on. This should be hard. What did she say? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
God, I should have left the cheese in the damn fridge. It's like melted. All right. Mm. Let's just go. Let's just go forward to where. Because I don't see anything like really happening here. She's just cooking. Yeah, okay. oh, you were in the bathroom. They did? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see what she. She's going to sit down and eat. And let's Hi, see. Uh... Hi, Maud. Leave me alone. I just want to talk to you, B. Maud, come on. Let me in. We're not letting her in. Mocha choke bullshit. Yeah. No, really. Very nice, normal person. Who did that happen? It was very sweet. Josh says that. Am I Shane? Uh, Gina, it seems like you two have more in common, so maybe you should try. Okay, here I come. Dr. Montego, permission to put my hand in your armpit? Oh no. Oh, you fucking gross. No. What? Yeah. What did you do? Like, legitimate counseling? If anyone asks, you're having trouble adjusting to your parents' new living situation, and it's not your fault. That's been crazy. Hi, um. Hey, Curly. I'm sorry, it's not going to happen this time around, unfortunately. And I've not had a chance to email, but. Okay. Maybe next time, hopefully. But, like, I need at least to stay next time for like two weeks or something so I can, you know, have. You know. Next time? Shit! There ain't gonna be no next time, girl. Tell ya, it's only because of the books, and I won't take up any more of your time. But it's six fifty for the burger. I'm, I'm just kidding. It's not what, right, boy? What do you guys think? I I think that I don't think he's gonna be uh, well, you know, pushing for her to come back anytime soon. Oh, I really kidding. don't. Burger's on the house. <laughs> you see, I'm a mm. I think yeah, he knows he like, can't handle yeah, her. Yeah, really. Yeah, let's start over. Clean slate. Hi, I'm Linda, and I haven't held you hostage in my restaurant at all tonight. <laughs> And so what's your name? Yeah, Shani well. does do it a lot, doesn't she, boo? Ew! Excuse me. Don't be nasty. What's happening here? <laughs> so you maybe consider writing another spare with Uh-huh. Whatever I have to say until you're gone. Oh, great. Well, so nice to meet you. It's all right, Curly. Maybe next time. <laughs> and plus, you know, I've had this, like, weird sickness and crap and... But I still want to see the rest of oh, uh, Wyoming. Sorry. And me and Josh will definitely do that at some point. What am I drinking? Water. Yes, that was my fucking spit rag. Yes, it was. That's why I said gross, because I'm a fucking Ew. dumbass sometimes. But... Your spit rag? What I the not fuck touch is a spit, spit rag? Thankfully, but, uh, ugh, I just, I swear to God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm not airhead for nothing. And I'm not messy Jesse for nothing either. Girls. I could never be a dainty little princess. No, you couldn't, could you? Ask you to. No, I'm not saying. I'm not. I know you don't expect me to be a dainty princess, Josh. I'm just your crazy goddess. <laughs> Goddess? Girl, calm down. You said you're crazy. Yeah. I'm crazy about you. Oh. Uh, what were you going to say? Finish your thought. So cute. No, so you said it, not me. Hey. That makes two of us, huh? Uh. <laughs> two peas in a pond? Yeah, right. Medicine for you, cat. I've never met in my life. All right. So, uh, you're really good at this. I should have bought more Icelandic oh, waters. Maybe Snow and Oak could do a corn the go. That would be fun. You can't find purple Pyrex anywhere. I collected all of that from the thrift store. Like over, you know, over time. Because trust me, when I, ugh, I don't even know when I found that stuff. But uh, I know at the time when I bought it, I think the purple Pyrex was like hot to like resell, but I wasn't reselling it because I wanted to keep it for myself. So. And if it helps, 
Yeah, the mountains are beautiful in Virginia. Uh, I've only seen Charlottesville. That took my breath away too when I went up there. I was like obsessed with it. Uh, I do not have a P.O. box. Just a regular house address. Mm. I need to get more uh, ice. Yeah, it's different. God damn it, I should have got... It's, it's fucking hell to get to that goddamn I cannot stand tree. her hacking up shit. It's so gross. Just stop. It's good. I should have bought more She's ice done that every day. Did. Seriously, you put some ice in this and put some, oh my God, it is instantly <laughs> brain freezing cold. It is so good. I just wish I had a lemon. Okay, let me fast forward for that. Well, when does she come back? Shoots up like a missile. A mash missile? My Louise, a thief? No. God damn it. No, no, not my Louise. Well, I'm off to my counseling seminar. It's on executive function. And it's a luncheon. It's an executive function luncheon. Gotcha. But when I'm back this afternoon, I'll skillfully question Louise. She'll confess and then we can move on with our lives. What if she doesn't do this? Where'd my eyes go? She did it. If she doesn't, she still did it. Because I can't find a way this incident report until I have a name. Oh, and I put the incident report in this thing. Did you know we had these for the whole stream? They're fun. Hey, Barb, I was at the pie place, just one of the pies, and they had a promotion where people put their business card to bowl. Hi, Becky. One, and winner gets a free lunch. Hi, Underground. Uh, yeah, maybe. I, I could be the first to answer. Is this your business card that you handed out to people? Yeah, I mean, it's a little old. You don't like it? What's the matter with you? Well, it says the handy hubby, and hubby is crossed out, so All it right. just says is the she handy. Talk yeah, well, what? I was married when I had those made. I wasn't. Yeah, and also, I can't read your phone number. Yeah, because I changed wow. my phone Why is water? Do you wrote your new number? Okay, literally, what's going on here? I don't need this one. I mean, Teddy, I don't think you want a card that says the handy and then a phone number written in pen. It may be time to get new cards. It is? I think they're not expensive nowadays. You can <laughs> Let's do it. No, I was going to be involved. I need, to laugh. I need your autistic eyes. Unless you can help me not get hacked. Why would you get hacked? I don't know. Oh, wait. It's your laptop. You'd be getting hacked. So I can go get it or what? Oh, my God. Rose already decided to release saw that kid's toy. Did All right, you? Jessica. Mm, that is a good taste in Is this it? Mom, remember? No, I'm using the same hair, hair stuff. stuff. I'm going to the nurse's office for a band-aid. I scraped my knee. Skirt life, am I right? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, back in a sack. Okay. Tina. Yeah? Listen, I got a question about Louise. Hey, guys. Shh, 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 shh. We're whispering for some reason. Fine. Need anything from the bathroom? Up, up, up. Hold on. I can give you maybe 30 seconds. Do you two know anything about a mash missile getting stolen? Oh, yeah. Jason Jeffers' Barobu mash missile. Wait, Barobu? Wow. Well, that's that thing boring. Releases? No, right? Yeah, probably not. But I need mean, past 30 seconds. A lot of homework. It's coming, fourth graders. It's coming. Okay, okay. kids, go. You go. I already did it. Let's see this quote unquote lucky pencil. Listen, I don't know how else to ask this, so I'm just gonna ask. I'm also slightly hurt you think I do that in the first place. I mean, I'm a spunky kid, but a thief? No, ma'am. I know, I know. And I was also a spunky kid. I uh, borrowed stuff in stores. You know, I set a few fires, I get it. Jeez, mom. Not big fires, just small ones. No one got big, but it started small. The point is, I understand. You can tell me if you did it. Mom, I'm telling you, I didn't do it. Even though it was Barobu, it's your favorite thing. Yeah, I love Barobu. Cards. But the Barobu mash missile is dumb. It has nothing to do with the cards or the world. Right. Okay. Too dumb for you to steal. Wait, why are you asking me this, Mom? Does someone think I did it? No, no. Why no, did she have no. the stuffed animal in front of the camera? Like, wouldn't it be really easy to have just moved that out of the way? Oh, no. Okay, you just Maybe that's so just me. Times. I love you. Goodbye. Okay, all right. She's back. So Louise is innocent. And this defraud is going to try and pin it on her anyway. Oh.
I think that's it. Is it over? Is it done or? Okay, yeah, it's over. She didn't say bye or anything. Well, damn. All right, let me pull up the one that uh, DM3 was asking about earlier. We're not going to watch the whole thing. Just the part where she starts freaking out, basically. Uh, so, this is from Boglum Chronicles. I'm dropping the link in the chat for them. Unplug it? Where is it plugged in? Where's the plug? Yeah, I can't do that. Oh, there's a button. Okay, I know the button. Well, do you know the button? Do I know the button? If you don't know the button, how do I know the button? You know more about it than I do, but if you don't know about it, then don't tell me. How about that? <clears throat> that seems like a simple, simpleton fucking mathematics equation right there. Oh, don't touch the button. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, they went out somewhere. I don't know where they went, but yeah, they, they went out somewhere. Um, I don't know who, uh, that person feather was that was in here um but feather you don't know what you're talking about and let me show you why so we have 181 people in here correct okay well auntie jesse's live right now too she has 134 people so she doesn't have more people watching her than me. So go fuck yourself. How about that? Okay, moving on. Yeah. Yeah, well, when you're to show out in public you don't want to go out so oh i know it was a troll of course it was a troll i mean look at the name that's fine well i know i'm ugly that's fine. when you know you're ugly you, you don't expect much <laughs> oh but i am ugly so please don't even try to pretend to be nice to me okay i just she cannot take a compliment and it's so irritating. Like, she will not. No, the nicer, it's almost like the nicer the people are to her, the more that she gets mad. Like, it pisses her off when people are like, you're not ugly, you're pretty, or whatever. You know what I mean? Like, it, it, she can't accept it. Thank you. Let me call myself ugly because that's what I am. I have the proof that I'm ugly. I'm not worth shit. That's fine. I know what I'm worth. And that's zero. And that's fine. So, like, don't waste your lies on me, please, because I'm not even going to accept it. Nah. When I've done nothing but fucking what I've said I'd fucking do. I'm the unstable one. All right. Okay. Right. I'm the unstable one. What have I done to deserve what's been done to me? Exactly. That You can't answer that. Yeah, exactly. You can't answer that. What have I done? Nothing. Expen except spend all of my fucking... See, the thing that's crazy about this is she didn't seem drunk, really, here at this part. So, what do you guys, I mean, do you think that she was really, like, drunk already? Or, because to me, she doesn't seem that drunk. She just seems genuinely pissed. And 
uh, money for Josh. Okay. I, I, what have I done? And what have I got in return? Okay. Yeah. What all have I done for him? And what have I got in fucking return? I'll, I'll wait. I'll, I'll wait. I'll wait for that one. Yeah. I'll wait for that one. Don't mean shit to me when I'm being lied to. Thank you. You can lie to me all the fuck you want. It's not gonna mean fuck to me. I know I'm retarded. I know I give too many people a chance. Oh, so, yeah, that's your problem. That's supposed to... Is that actually supposed to mean something? Oh, cool. Perfect shabby cat. You said my fiancé and I make uh make kind cobra ytp um check out the channel cobra sauce for more cobra content <laughs> okay is that supposed to mean something okay <laughs> that's a joke then okay i know i'm fucking useless <laughs> don't have to fucking tell me twice <laughs> narcissist they can fucking sneak around the circumstances you only get my trust once, so. Yeah, I think it's um, I agree. What do you mean? What are you saying no to, Thelma? Um, no, Carrie. This woman has had abuse her whole life, I would say, and she has never gotten help. I've never argued that fact. I think she's had problems and uh definitely trauma and things that have had to have happened in her younger days um and clearly she hasn't gotten the help that she needs i feel for her too but i also think that she's got to make a choice and unfortunately unless she wants to change there's nothing anybody's going to be able to do it's about time for me to go to bed so <laughs> Oh, did I really do a good job, or am I just a stupid bitch? <laughs> That's the real question. Did I do a good job, or am I just a stupid bitch? I will be harder than on myself than any fucking liar. Oh, well, I get you're saying that you um were saying you don't think she's drunk there. Um... It just ended up the way that you, when you said it, it seemed like because of what you said after it, that you were talking about that that was in context with the rest of the thing that you, that you wrote. So that's why I took it that way. Yeah, I, I don't care. I, I literally don't care anymore. Okay. I got you. Thank you, Delma. I'm, and I don't feel like I was like trying to call you out or anything like that. I was just genuinely trying to hear whatever um you know you thought was going on i thought that uh I, I don't care but i get it now i get it i'm not worthy of fuck in this lifetime i'm not worthy of love i'm not worthy of respect i'm not worthy of f fucking shit thank you i'm gonna go to sleep that's what i'm gonna do that's since i've literally been cleaning all day and i don't get no fucking respect uh, I don't get no respect. And then afterwards, oh, the pretend respect. No, I don't want pretend fucking fake shit either. Nope. I rebuke that at any given fucking, yeah. <laughs> Give it to that fucking ugly. Dad, how about that? Yeah, she, I remember this. She muted the stream for a long time. She's probably glad about the part that was, uh, you know, muted. Because, I mean, can you imagine the stuff that she was saying right then? She was fucking livid. Livid.
need to find someone that can read lips, you know, like somebody that can read lips really well and then transcribe this and like tell us what all was being said. I guarantee you somebody out there can probably do it. Throwing shit. Oh, I need to let a demon out when I haven't been fucking respected. Okay. I need to let a demon out when I haven't been respected. Okay, so this is my fault. Put some respect on my name. This is my fault I'm not being treated the way I deserve to be treated because I've done nothing but give him fucking king status. So this is my fault I'm being treated like this. Okay, thanks. Thank you for letting me know that. Thank you. If that's how you treat a king, I mean, come on. Yeah, that's, I wouldn't go that far, okay? I just wouldn't go that far. Sure, you're nice to nice enough to him, but you're not, you don't treat him like a king either. For letting me know that. Oh, and hi, danger. Goodbye. You're not a mod no more because I saw your fucking comment. So fuck you too, bitch. I saw your comment. <laughs> I, I I saw your comment. So <laughs> yeah, it's a hundred percent my fault. Okay, because I've done everything for Josh. That's fine. I've spent all of my travel money on Josh's place. Or for well, it was his birthday. I mean, it's not like you had to pay to go there. You didn't. All of that was paid for. So, you want now you want to make a big deal about the fact that you were buying him stuff. It was his birthday. What else, like, what else were you, like, isn't that what you wanted to do? I just don't understand now, like, holding it over his head, um, that she spent money on him. For Josh, but I deserve to be treated. Okay, that's fine. I'm glad. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for confirming that. Thank you. It's not as if I'm the one that flew over here for six plus fucking hours, waiting at the airport for an hour and 30 minutes to be picked up just to be treated like this, right? Because I've done the fucking most to be treated like this. Okay, that's fine. So I deserve to be treated. Is that what you men are saying? Because your mother's never taught you shit. Okay. I deserve to be treated like this. Okay, gotcha. I deserve to be treated like this because I tried twice to go see him to be treated like this. Okay. Gotcha. Thanks. Thanks. Wow. I don't give a fuck if other people paid for it. I'm the one that fucking accepted it and fucking took my time to fucking fly out here. <laughs> This is where she starts sounding like a demon, for real, like a straight-up demon. And she actually, like, barks. If you listen to this, listen to it, at, right at the end of what she's saying, she's like, Arr! like, she literally barks like a dog. I don't give a fuck if other people paid for it! I'm the one that fucking accepted it and fucking took my time to fucking fly out here! Arr! Arr! Like, well, I'm God. not moving here, okay? I'm not moving here. Josh has someone else in his mind. I'm not his first choice because if I was his first choice, I wouldn't be some fucking sec. I wouldn't be some fucking six months demogorgon. Josh has someone else on his mind. So when you don't see me here no more, it's because Josh chose someone else over me. So 
I don't know. He'll show you his new girlfriend in due time. I don't know who his new girlfriend is, but it's not me, so... I, I hope that girl he fucking loves so much wants his fucking ass. I, I hope that what he did was worth it. <laughs> After all I've fucking done for him, I get treated the fucking way I get treated? Okay, that's fine. Wow. I have every right to fucking go manic then. Why? After what I've fucking done for him. What did he do? Especially after today. I hope you get all your ex-girlfriends back because I'm not one of them. I will never be an ex-girlfriend because I was never a girlfriend. Because I was never good enough. That's fine. I was never good enough. That's fine. Wait, there's got to be more. Hold on. Um, let me pull up the stream that I was watching earlier. Hold on, guys. Because there's more to this that I was going to show. Where she starts talking about fishnet stockings. Uh, here it is. I'll find the part that we were at. Okay. See. Who gives a fuck? That's trash. Um, don't mean shit. Trigger me. warning because she says some like uh you know um slurs and things like that. It sounds like the volume is pretty low too. Don't mean shit to me when for I'm being some reason. Lied to. Thank you. I can't you hear can it. You can lie to me all the fuck you want. It's not gonna mean fuck to me. All right. Let me see where the part is that oh no i'm a stupid bitch oh, um, i need another white sponge to get that that mm. done vacuuming done this is on the channel chris by the way scrubbing done mm, i think it's about time for me to go to is bed. the volume really low for you guys uh, it sounds really low so. <laughs> for some reason. Maybe it's just the video. Oh, did I really do a good job or am I just a stupid bitch? <laughs> That's the real question. Did I do a good job or am I just a stupid bitch? Oh, no, I'm a stupid bitch. Oh. Oh, is it so it's super low for y'all too? I wonder if it's just. Hold on, let me see something really quick. Yeah, it must just be that video because the other one that we just watched was uh, fine. So let me see if I can find... Where would it be? No, no, we might just have to watch it, uh, the one that's kind of quiet. What about this one? Hold on. All right, I think I got one that is a little bit louder. Okay, this is on a different channel. This is JS. Um, and uh, this one, the sound. Don't see him to be treated like this. Okay. Oh, gotcha. Thanks. Thanks. All right, so we're back to this part. Let me fast forward. People paid for it. 
I am the one that fucking accepted it. And f okay, here we go. This is where we were at, right? I'm pretty sure. I don't give a fuck if other people paid for it. I am the one that fucking accepted it and fucking took my time to fucking fly out here. There's the barking one. And then she's muted for a long time. So we, we're going to go fast forward through that. When does she figure it out? All right, here we go. Is it after this DM3? Is this, I'm, are we getting close to where it's at? Do you know where it's at in the stream? Just so I make sure I don't miss it. I don't know if it was in the earlier part or if it's in this part. <laughs> Hey, you fucking stupid retard bitch. Man, she was doing a lot of angry cleaning. Well, I'm not moving here, okay? I'm not moving here. Josh has someone else in his mind. I'm not his first choice because if I was his first choice, I wouldn't be some fucking sec. I wouldn't be some fucking six months Demogorgon fucking goddamn fucking cunt. Josh has someone else on his mind. So when you don't see me here no more, it's because Josh chose someone else over me. So, so literally fuck yourself. Thank you. Okay. When Josh chooses somebody else over me, and you don't see me here no more, don't come crying. She loves slamming shit around, dude. I don't know. He'll show you his new girlfriend in due time. I don't know who his new girlfriend is, but it's not me. So he'll 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 fucking tell you. He'll be jacking off to that fucking cunt in no time. So Ew. Yeah. He'll be jacking off to that fucking whore in no time. So Yikes. Josh doesn't want me. At the end of the day, I'm telling you, Josh doesn't want me. So, yeah. He, hopefully, he'll have a new girlfriend soon because it's not going to be me. Mm. It's not going to be me. So, I, I hope that girl he fucking loves so much wants his fucking ass. I fucking hope she does. I fucking hope she wants his ass so fucking much. He better fucking goddamn fucking hope so. Wow. Because otherwise, it'll be a mistake on his ass, but he had to fucking do it. Yeah. He had to do it. Because yeah, I'm a nobody. So I'm triggered. A nobody. God. So triggered. I, I hope that what he did was worth it. After all I've fucking done for him, I get treated the fucking way I get treated. Okay, that's fine. I have every right to fucking go manic then. After what I've fucking done for him. <sighs> Especially after today. And you want to, okay. So be it, then you don't want me. So quit making up lies about me and acting like I'm supposed to believe it. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to fucking fake pretend. You're saying this stuff about me because you fucking believe it from, nah, 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 nah. Nah, that's not how it works. <laughs> it don't work that way. It doesn't work that way. So whatever blonde fucking triple E, goddamn triple Z fucking tit whore blonde fucking slut you want to marry, 
I hope she wants to marry you too. Because it ain't wow. going to be me. Already going to marriage. I mean. All your fucking lies towards me. All your fucking deceit. Yeah. I, I know I'm fucking worthless cunt. That's fine. I know. You, you don't have to pretend. <laughs> I'm a worthless cunt. <laughs> As if I haven't been told that my whole fucking you think you're brand new to telling me lies? Okay, well, so be it then, I guess. I hope you get all your ex-girlfriends back because I'm not one of them. I will never be an ex-girlfriend because I was never a girlfriend. Because I was never good enough. That's fine. I was never good enough. That's fine. You don't have to fucking lie to me and pretend well, I'm good enough, okay? That's not how it works. That's not how it works. So he can have his blonde fucking goth whore fucking... If that's what he wants, that's what he gets. That's fine. Oh, God. He, he chose the choice. That's fine. I've been here twice, and that's your choice? It speaks volumes to me that I'm ugly and I'm not worthy of fuck. So don't keep lying to me because I'm not going to believe fucking shit, retard. Oh, boy. Remember what I said about the slurs. Trigger warning. Thank you, DM3. I see it. I didn't fucking see this blonde haired fucking fucking Z tip fucking whore cleaning his fucking kitchen. Oh boy. I didn't Here see this go. whore cleaning his kitchen and sucking his dick and washing his walls, but he'll jack off to her. <laughs> I didn't see her cleaning his fucking kitchen. I didn't see this fucking whore cleaning his kitchen, did I? No, the fuck I didn't. Oh, God. And now she's saying none of this is true. Loves the throat shit, I've noticed. Throwing it and slamming it. Ready for this? Here we go. Where's the fucking blonde whore with the fucking tits? And a fish, and a fish, and a fish, and a fish. And a fish, and a fish. Where's that fucking blonde cunt whore? Where is she? Where is she? Where's that fucking whore at? Is she sucking Josh's dick? Is she fucking cleaning his kitchen? Where's that fucking whore? God. Oh, whores don't clean his. Oh, girlfriends clean the house. Whores suck his dick. All right. So whores get the attention. Girlfriends don't get shit. So probably the whore is sucking his dick right fucking now while I'm still cleaning his fucking apartment. <laughs> so I'll whores get the that. fucking ultimate treatment at the end of the day because they don't have to clean shit and they still get what the fuck they want out at the end of the day. And they don't gotta do shit for it except stick their stinky fucking pussies out. Ew. Their stinky pussy. They gotta put their stinky pussy out. 
God. Uh, I could have gotten the most out of Josh if I was a fucking whore instead of a real cunt. Yeah, okay. So Josh gives this fucking bitch more attention than me. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I don't think it's fine. I don't think it's fine. I think that you're really not fine with it. Damn, dude. She is cleaning away, though. Like, just on this fucking, I mean, I don't know what she's on, but she's got a lot of fucking energy. Can I roll it back? How far do you, where do you want me to go back to? part okay, so josh gives this fucking bitch more attention than me oh, that's fine the fish that thing again okay here hold on fucking now while i'm still cleaning this fucking where's that where is she where's that fucking whore at is she sucking josh's dick wait or... they're back hold on all right, I think it's right here. Let's see. Fucking fucking Z tip fucking whore cleaning his fucking kitchen. I didn't see this whore cleaning his kitchen and sucking his dick and washing his walls, but he'll jack off to her. <laughs> I didn't see her cleaning his fucking kitchen. I didn't see this fucking whore cleaning his kitchen, did I? No, the fuck I didn't. Coming up. Blonde cunt horror. Where is she? Right. No. One more time. Where's the fucking blonde horror with the fucking tits? And a fish net, and a fish net, and a fish net, and a fish. Where's that fucking blonde cunt? Oh, I got an idea. Hold on. One more thing. Where's the fucking blonde whore? What's, I want to hear this. I want to see it slowed down, what it's like. Oh god, I 
Is she that. sucking Josh's dick? Is she fucking cleaning his kitchen? Where's that fucking whore? <laughs> oh, whores don't clean his... Oh, girlfriends clean the house. Whores suck his dick. All right. So whores get the attention. Girlfriends don't get shit. So probably the whore is sucking his dick right fucking now. While I'm still cleaning his fucking apartment. Uh. So whores get the fucking ultimate treatment at the end of the day because they don't have to clean shit and they still get what the fuck they want out at the end of the day. And they don't got to do shit for it except stick their stinky fucking pussies out. Uh, their stinky pussy. Uh, they got to put their stinky pussy out. So, huh. I could have gotten the most out of Josh if I was a fucking whore instead of a real cunt. Yeah, okay. So Josh gives this fucking bitch more attention than me. That's fine. That's fine. Wow. She is on it. Like, she is just going nuts. Cleaning. The cleaning is what's so crazy. This is the angriest cleaning I've ever seen in my life. Or fucking blind slut. Oh, she should do roller derby. Soren, she seems like the type of chick that would be really good at, at something like roller derby. She actually really gen genuinely does seem like it. I know I'm ugly. I've been told my whole life. You don't get to tell me otherwise. I don't give a fuck who the fuck you are. You're my pretend boyfriend or whoever the fuck you are. You don't get to lie to me and pretend. Nah, the fuck you don't. Nah, you don't get to pretend while you do the fucking utmost behind my back. No, that's not. I think she's supposed to leave tomorrow, but I don't know if that's going to happen or not. There's mixed things that are being said, like that her um, ticket, her plane ticket, back home has been canceled or something so it'll be interesting interesting to see what happens not how it works no that's 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 not how it works nope that's not how it works nope that's not how it works Nope, that's not how it works. Nope, that's not how it works. Nope, 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 nope. I hope that blonde whore wants his ass. I hope that fucking blonde whore with the tits out the hurt wants his ass. Because that's what he's going to end up with. And she won't do fucking shit for him. She'll cheat on him talking to fucking 500 men. And she won't do nothing for Josh. And Josh will lose out. And Josh will fucking realize what he missed out on because I'm fucking ugly. So that's fine, Josh. You made your decision. You made your decision. You pretend like I'm this. I'm, no, you made your decision. So good luck to you, Josh. Good luck to you. You made your decision. That's fine. You think with your cock, not with your fucking head. That's fine. You made your decision. That's fine. I'm ugly as fuck. You don't have to pretend to lie and think I'm something. You can tell me I'm ugly just like every fucking other fucking faggot. You don't have to fucking pretend to lie. You can straight be a fucking... Oh, you, do you think not what you did to me earlier fucking was a cut to my throat? Okay. Don't act like what you're doing ain't much fucking different. Okay. Don't act like what you're doing ain't much fucking different. You've probably already fucked her behind the scenes. Yikes. So I hope that fucking ugly Fucking probably underage bitch is good enough for you. 
I hope she's good enough for you because she ain't gonna fucking respond back to you. That's fine. She ain't gonna fucking respond back to you. But you respond back to her because your fucking cock says whatever it fucking tells you to do. Even though you got a fucking bitch here that fucking flown to you twice and I'm not good enough. That's fine. I hope she's good enough for you when she rejects your fucking dick. When you want to get hard and off and you can't call me because I was a loyal fucking cunt. Yikes. Oh my god. I thought she was seriously going to break some shit. I was a loyal cunt, but you couldn't handle that because you had to fucking do what you had to do behind my back. That's fine. That's fine. You had to do what you had to do behind my back. That's fine. Ugh. What's done in the dark comes to the light, so... You want that fucking whore? You should have tried harder for her fucking ass. Because now that's all you get is her and plus whatever fucking other ugly sluts are on your fucking computer. Because you're going to delete all of that shit of me. I'm not going to have none of my shit on your fucking computer. You can delete all of that. All of it. I'm not going to have that. No, you ain't fucking goddamn loyal to me when I'm loyal to you. No. What is, what is on his computer of you? Was that like, I mean, was that, was she, are you saying that y'all have maybe made some stuff? That there's some stuff on his computer? You can delete all of that and get your own fucking shit to jack off here because it's not going to be me. It's not going to be me. You can have what the fuck you want and what, yeah, it ain't going to be me. You chose what you chose, and what you get is what you get. So don't come crying. Don't come crying to me when you can't. Yeah, I don't want to hear it. Don't come fucking crying to me when you can't get the pussy you need on a nightly basis. Because I'll give you whatever the fuck you want, but you gotta fucking cheat on me. You gotta cheat on me. Because huh? I'm not worthy of fucking respect or fucking shit, loyalty, nothing. I don't deserve respect. I don't deserve loyalty after all the fuck I've goddamn done. I deserve to be cheated on. Yeah. Oh, Vera, I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh, my gosh. Can you guys put some hearts in the chat for Vera, please? That would mean a lot to me. I'm sorry, Vera. I deserve to be cheated on. Yes, I do. I have done the most. I have done the most and deserve to be cheated on because I'm ugly. And if you don't want a fucking ugly whore, then don't fucking fuck her, you fucking retard. Why is she putting Dawn on everything? Good lord. She is going in with that Dawn. All right, good night, people. I'm worthless. He's got a blonde girlfriend with big tits, and she looks like the girlfriend of his dreams. So have a good night. I'm deleting this. Josh has a new girlfriend and it's not me, so good night. All right. That's it, folks. Oh my God. What a wild ride that is. She is something else. Um, that is gonna do it for me for now. 
Um, thank you so much for hanging out. I'm going to keep, before I end it, let me make sure, let me double check that she's not live again or anything. Hold on. All right. No, she's not live. All right. Um, I haven't seen. Sh let me see. Let me check if Shani's live. Hold on. I'll just check. Check all of it while I'm here still. Maybe. Okay. No new Shani and Rev. And I don't think there's any new crystal. But let me check there. There is some new stuff that's on the archive channels that I haven't covered of her. So maybe later on we'll do that. Maybe like tonight. Um, but for now, I am going to... Um, Wrap it up. I'm going to go get something to eat. And um, and I'll probably be back later on. So thanks again, guys, for hanging out. And I will see you on the next one. Bye, everybody.